I like you, Jack. Well, maybe not. But I understand you. You feel some loyalty to your badge that has been rewarded. But you didn't count on the people who gave you that badge. And let me tell you what's going to happen so you can prepare yourself. Soon there's going to be a knock on the door. And you're going to be asked to be called outside. There's a man in the hall who outranks you. First, he's going to compliment you on a fine job you have done in keeping the world a safer place. And he's going to tell you that I have to be released. You will protest. You may even threaten to resign. But in the end, I will be released. The reason why I be the release is the same you think why I should be convicted. I rubbed elbows with the most vile, sadistic men who call themselves leaders today. But those same men are enemies of your enemies. And while the biggest arm dealer in the world is your boss, the President of the United States, who does more merchandising in a day than I do in a year, <laughs> it's embarrassing to see his fingerprints on the guns. Sometimes he needs a freelancer like me to supply the opposite forces that he can't supply. You may call me evil, but unfortunately from you, I'm a necessary evil. I like you, Jack. Well, maybe not. <laughs> but I understand you. You feel some loyalty to your badge that could be rewarded. But you forgot to count on the people who gave you that badge. Let me tell you what's going to happen so you can prepare yourself. Soon, there's going to be a knock on that door. And you'll be asked to call outside. There's going to be a man in the hall who outranks you. First, he's going to compliment you on how a fine job you did and how keeping the world a safer place. Hell, even you get a promotion. But then he'll tell you that I will be released. Oh, you throw a protest? <laughs> hey, maybe you'll resign from your job. But in the end, I will be released. <laughs> The reason why I'll be released is the same reason you want me convicted. I rub elbows with the most vile, sadistic men that call themselves leaders today. But those same men are enemies of your enemies. And while the biggest arms deal in the world is your boss, the President of the United States, who does more merchandising in a day than I do in a year, it's embarrassing to find his fingerprints on a gun. Sometimes he needs a freelancer like me to supply the opposite forces so he doesn't have to. Though you may call me evil, the unfortunate thing is, I'm a necessary evil. <laughs>